My name is Brynhild Davisdottir, a professor in Environment and Natural Resources, and I want to tell you about the master's program in Environment and Natural Resources at University of Iceland. We are witnessing environmental change that is historically unique, and human well-being will be severely affected if we follow business as usual. Explaining the causes and consequences, reporting on the relevant issues, designing the appropriate management methods, and figuring out how to stay within planetary boundaries while securing well-being for all relies on international and interdisciplinary knowledge and experience. This is precisely the focus of the International and Interdisciplinary Master's Programme in Environment and Natural Resources. That is, to understand the character, reasons and consequences of environmental change and natural resource use, to identify and analyze the challenges, and to analyze and propose solutions. Cross-cutting issues through everything they do in the program include sustainable development, well-being, the circular economy, and eco-innovation. There are multiple benefits of participating in an interdisciplinary and international program. You will have an opportunity to analyze challenges and solutions from many perspectives and to work in international and interdisciplinary teams. You will also have an opportunity to learn from a diverse group of scientists throughout the University of Iceland and beyond. And you will have an opportunity to study in an international environment the most pressing issues the world is facing today and become part of an international network of our graduates. Upon graduation, diverse opportunities are available, including in institutions, ministries and municipalities, in consulting within various private firms, for example, as environmental and sustainability specialists, within international agencies and institutions, and then, of course, in research and teaching. And now I want to tell you a bit more about our program. It is jointly organized by all five schools at the University of Iceland. It is both inter and transdisciplinary and theoretical and practical at the same time. We have both international teachers and student groups and the entire program is conducted in English. Our students have diverse backgrounds from arts and humanities, social sciences, business and economics, to natural and physical sciences and engineering. This diversity, both in terms of backgrounds and nationalities, creates incredible collective learning in our classrooms. The program is structured as a two-year program, or 120 credits, to be completed in four semesters, and consists of courses and a master's thesis. Everyone completes a specific core courses where core knowledge is secured. All need to complete a course in research methods or what is called restrictive electives. And then students can select other electives from diverse courses from throughout the university. The master's thesis itself can then be either completed in one or two semesters. The program is very flexible, and through the coursework and the master's thesis, our students are able to create their own individualized specialization based on their interests. And all of this is done through seven specializations. The subject of the environmental management, science and policy specialization are environmental issues from diverse perspectives where causes and solutions to various environmental issues are analyzed. Thesis projects focus on, for example, well-being and the circular economy, corporate sustainability, waste and pollution in diverse contexts, climate change mitigation and adaptation, and then environmental management and policy at diverse scales. The subject of the natural resources specialization is the sustainable management of natural resources from various perspectives with a focus on land-based resources. 
thesis projects focus on, for example, management of protected areas and national parks, land use with respect to, for example, ecosystem services, healthy soils and forests, restoration of, for example, wetlands, and wild species conservation and management. The subject of the ocean sustainability specialization are the diverse sustainability challenges facing the world's oceans, with a particular focus on the blue economy and the conservation and sustainable use of marine resources. Thesis projects focus on, for example, marine resource management, including fishery management, marine protected areas, ecosystem services, aquaculture, and zero waste use of marine resources. The subject of the energy sustainability specialization is the sustainable development of energy systems, where the focus is on the development of energy resources and energy use in the context of sustainability and climate change. Thesis projects focus on, for example, identifying sustainable pathways for energy development, life cycle assessments and cost-benefit assessments in that context, sustainability assessments and indicators, enhanced energy efficiency, and energy policy analyses. The subject of the sustainability management and informatics specialization is interdisciplinary analysis of sustainability and well-being. Particular emphasis is on the development, analysis and use of the ecological footprint. Thesis projects focus on, for example, the ecological footprint and analyses at various scales, assessments of biocapacity, measures of well-being, and then the relationship between the ecological footprint and other well-being measures. The subject of the Sustainable Agriculture and Rural Development Specialization is to investigate how to realize thriving sustainable agriculture in harmony with the environment and society. Thesis projects focus on, for example, carbon neutral agriculture, zero waste agriculture, sustainable land use, animal welfare, and agricultural policies. Finally, we have an open specialization for students who want to get comprehensive knowledge of the environment and natural resources and want to focus on subjects not defined in the other specializations. This has in the past included projects that focus on the environment and health or education for sustainable development. The master thesis is selected based on student interests and our students are advised by faculty members from throughout the university. And our students then graduate with an MA or an MS in Environment and Natural Resources from different faculties within University of Iceland. To enroll in our program, you need to have completed any bachelor's degree with a GPA of 7.25 or higher. The application documents include transcripts, letter of motivation, confirmation of English proficiency, your CV, and two letters of recommendation. So is the master's program in Environment and Natural Resources something for you? Well, if you are interested in international and solutions-based knowledge of the environment and natural resources in the context of sustainability and well-being, and if you want to have the opportunity to build your own individualized specialization where you have the flexibility to select topics according to your interests, and you want to have multiple and diverse career opportunities at graduation and you want to study an international program in Iceland, the Environment and Natural Resources Master's program at University of Iceland is something for you. For more information, please do not hesitate to contact us through email, phone or simply by exploring our website. You can apply for the program at the University of Iceland website. The application deadline is February 1st for international applicants, but April 15th for Icelandic and Nordic 
applicants.